Hey guys, I have already filmed this video and the camera did something weird when I was trying to upload it to the computer and edit it, so I'm going to do it again, or attempt to here anyway. Is a review on some more pharmacy stuff. I know a while ago they had sent me the New Day Gentle Exfoliating Grains that I think I just did a blog post on it, so I didn't talk about it in a video, but it's like a powder cleanser, face cleanser, that you just need like a little tiny shake of it in your hand and you put a little bit of water in it and it makes like a really nice foamy face wash, but I will talk about that more in a minute. They sent me a kit, it's called the, they have holiday seedling kits and they have all different ones on their website which I will link below so that you can get them. And it came in like a really cool cigar box which I was excited to repurpose for something else. So it had, everything was packaged in here really nicely with like the, the foam stuff so I will insert a picture so that you can see because I've already taken everything out because I already filmed this video. Um, but anyways, like I was saying, the first thing that came in there was the Gentle Exfoliating Grains. This is my second bottle of this because I have they sent me one before that I reviewed on its own. And this stuff is really nice. It smells like oatmeal when you um, scrub it all over your face. It's very, very gentle, so it's good for sensitive skin. Um, my skin is very oily. If you've been watching me for a while, then you know that I'm always complaining about oily skin. And this does a good job at, like, keeping me matte all day. It's made with ec something called Echinacea Green Envy, which is a unique patent-protected variant of Echinacea purpurea that contains the highest known concentration of yeah, right. <laughs> I can't pronounce any of this stuff. Sechoric acid, which provides the plant's restorative properties. It's a natural antioxidant and anti-inflammatory. So it helps, I've noticed that it does help with redness too. Like, my cheeks are always red. I don't, I don't know if it's rosacea or what, but I never had that before. And as I get older, I'm noticing that my cheeks are constantly red. Um, I do have blush on today, but I don't have uh, any other face makeup. Um, so the next thing was the blah, 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 the hydrating coconut gel mask which I haven't had a chance to use yet. Um, this is again it's a, it has the Echinacea Green Envy. It is soothing. I looked on the website they have five or six different ones which is really cool. They're sold in packs of three um, you can get them, I believe QVC sells their line, but their website is pharmacybeauty.com and they have them on Sephora now, they sell them. Um, so the masks come in packs of three. I will tell you how much it is. Hold on. The full size of this is a uh, three ounce bottle, so it's about twice this size. And a uh, 3.5 ounce bottle, sorry. And it retails for $30. Um, so just picture a bigger size of this and that's what the full size is but this is awesome I still have the other one even though I use it constantly I'm about halfway through it because you only need the teeniest little shake of it in your hand and now the um, the gel masks there are seven different kinds um, they come in packs of three for $24 a piece or they have a mask medley that has three different kinds in it. So three packs of these are $24 a piece. It's a sheet mask obviously that you leave on for 20 to 25 minutes. I'm excited to use this because I'm obsessed with masks. So that's that. And then um, this is the Sleep Tight Firming Night Balm. I don't know how well that's gonna... I love their packaging because it's just very... all the lids look like wood and natural. Um, so this... hold on, I'm trying to get you the info here. <laughs> this retails for $48. It is a... Um, but hold on, I don't think this is the full size. I just want to make sure. No, this is, this is not what the full size will look like. This is a 0.5 ounce like trial size. The full size is 1.7 ounces and retails for $48. So um, this is a night treatment 
So I guess it, it's kind of like, it works like a moisturizer. It is a lightweight balm that transforms into an oil, a gentle oil gel. And it has like a slight, kind of like a, I don't know how I would describe that, a plant smell, but it's citrusy a little bit. I don't know, but um, it's very like emollient, I guess is the word. Um, as you can see, it kind of looks like Vaseline, but it's much, much lighter, like lightweight and, whoa, I'm going blurry, in texture. I don't know if you can see. It feels like, almost like um, you're touching argon oil or something, any type of oil. But I was a little worried about that because I have oily skin and I don't really like using oils on my face, but it sinks right in. You can see it's not like all super greasy on my skin and it's just a nice nighttime treatment especially for the winter time when you're super dry because as oily as I am in the winter time I always get dry skin like right in this little triangle here and then around my nose I don't know why I can still be super oily and have like the little dry skin flakes so the last two things that I was super super excited about because I didn't even know that they made lip products are lip balms and they're called lip blooms they sent me two different kinds they sent citrus lemongrass and lavender mint this one just has like a very um, pleasant mint scent to it and then the citrus lemon lemongrass is uh, it just has a lemon scent to it I love this so much see it just looks like a normal clear lip balm um, this is the f what the full size ones will look like uh, 0.25 ounces. They have, in addition to these two scents, they have um, apple rosemary, they have honey ginger, vanilla mint, and strawberry basil. So I'm, I kind of want the apple one and the strawberry one too because I like this so much. It is very, it looks like nothing special. It looks like a plain, like, Vaseline lip balm, but it is it's not thick and goopy like Vaseline. It's a very light, but it stays on your lips for a really long time. That's like the number one thing I like in a lip balm that um what am I trying to say? If it's moisturizing, fine, but like if it doesn't stay on your lips, what's the point? You have to keep reapplying and reapplying. This will keep my lips moist moist. <laughs> I hate saying the word moist moisturized for hours um, I just like this so much I've been using it every night because it's an awesome like overnight lip balm it's just it feels it's one of those lip balms that feels really nice on your lips it's like if you rub them together they feel nice and smooth the day that I got these in the mail I had super chapped lips and I put this on and right away they felt better like it doesn't sting or anything if you have a, a split in your lip or something from them being super chapped so I highly, like, out of all this stuff, this is my favorite so far, the lips, the lip balms. Um, definitely recommend the citrus lemongrass one. The mint one is good too, but I mean, I love, I don't know, I just love the lemoniness of it. So, that is the stuff that came in this holiday seedling kit. I'm going to have all the information to where you can order this stuff below. Um, like I said, PharmacyBeauty.com and Sephora, they both sell them. I haven't seen it in the Sephora stores yet, but hopefully they'll get it soon. It's definitely on the website. They have all the same stuff on the Sephora site as they have on their pharmacy website. So um, that is everything for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will talk to you in my next one.